Yeah, so the People's Potato was a project, a really interesting project, and um, I was quite happy with the way it worked out because it was the large-scale project that the Frigo Verde generally wasn't, that the Frigo Verde, the Frigo Verde, I think it was very successful in some ways, but the People's Potato brought to the masses food security issues or better food or, hey, you could come every day and get free food. Pretty amazing, you know? And um, a great project, a really good idea that, that, that came, to, uh, came to work really well in the end. And, um, you know, I think not everyone learned about food politics or food security, but people could have learned things about the environment, and it was quite successful in that way. And, you know, maybe people could go back and learn how to, like, make food, how to, instead of just buying processed food, you know, every day they could eat really good quality, very healthy food. And so that was quite successful. I, I didn't know, I didn't have a lot of knowledge about it the intricacies of how it developed, but basically it was a real democratic um, organization that started with students having a referendum to ask for, I, I believe it was five cents per credit, which is it's quite low, and to fund the buying the materials, and then the volunteers cooked the food and served on a large scale. And I, I guess what was good at the time is like, even though the university administration really, really opposed having any kinds of these food cooperatives, in the end they were kind of forced to do it because it was so wildly popular. And a couple of times the administration attacked the, 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 the governance and uh, the money and how it was spent and things like that. And every time they did, it was wildly unpopular and they, they ended up having to like backtrack and then in a sense, they said, hey, we supported this thing all along, which is great because, you know, if they're going to do that, in the end, they, they do support it. It was good because they did give the space for it to go forward. But I guess it was, an, it was a very important project in, in uh, democracy at Concordia and how you could have an alternative to the big business and big business of food.